What is going on you guys? It is that time again for another Player Error Project. This time we're going to be doing Hall of Famer Johnny Robinson. He played from 1960 to 1971 and was elected to the Pro Football Hall of Fame in 2019. So there's a huge gap there. He hung him up in 1971, elected the Hall of Fame in 2019. That's 48 years he had to wait to get the call to the Hall, and I think that is a shame. But it's better late than no, better late than never. And I mean, his numbers were there all along. You know, like we say in baseball Hall of Fame and NFL Hall of Fame, and really all the Hall of Fames, the numbers are there. You know, why does it take so long to get some of these guys inducted? It's just beyond me. I have no clue. But seven-time Pro Bowl, six-time All-Pro. He won a Super Bowl and was a three-time AFL champ and has been a great, great ambassador to the TTM community for many, many years. So we'll turn the camera around and show off some of his cards. So this is his 1961 Topps rookie card. Um, I think this card is absolutely beautiful. Um, just the colors and everything like that just really pops. Um, just screams old school football, man. So moving on, this is his second year card. Um, 1963 Philadelphia. So he did not have... A second year card. This is the second um, player era card they produce of him. So he had the 61 tops rookie, and then he has the 63 here. And moving on to the 64, which I absolutely love this design. So, so cool. And the next is the 1965 tops tall boy. These are uh, bigger cards than normal. When I've been doing the player eras in the past and someone had a 65 tall boy, I haven't been sending it to them. Um, just because I cannot fit it in the case that I send it in. But I'm going to roll the dice and send it in this top loader. Moving on to the 1966, which this card is beat up. If we move down here, you can see this card doesn't exactly lay flat. Um, it actually has a pretty significant bow to it. But whatever, it is what it is. Moving on to the 67, which is one of my all-time favorite set designs. 1970 so he had nothing between the 67 and the 70 as far as player era tops cards and then his last player era card is the 1971 tops um just really cool card i've said this in the past i'm um, always like this um car or excuse me this this year because of this little guy down here i think it looks so funny and then this is our case with always ask them accept my donation and could you inscribe blah 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 and there's our donation so that is that this is the johnny robinson player era set it's only four cards excuse me only eight cards so let's see what happens so i just got in from checking the mail and this was in there uh, Monroe, Louisiana. No, this isn't something from the Robertsons of Duck Dynasty. <laughs> um, this should be Johnny Robinson, and I'm extremely anxious um, to open this TTM package or this player arrow package. Um, I just, I'd have never seen anyone get multiples of him signed, although he's been a great TTMer for so long. Um, I haven't seen, I think I've seen two people in the past couple of years since he's been in the Hall of Fame, get a Hall of Fame inscription. Um, so I'm really, really anxious to open this. I'm actually a little nervous for some reason. Um, so let's tear it open and see what's going on here. Now there's my tall boy backwards just put that there i have no clue what this is that's not my cards <laughs> but okay um, we'll get to that in a minute and everything is backwards um i guess great for the the video i guess um let's get into this small envelope and see what's going on here So you get, 
huh? Is this <laughs> okay? Um, yeah, this was my donation that I sent to him. Um, holy smokes, okay. We'll get to that in a minute. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Um, very, very cool. Um, this is so weird, okay. I'm, I'm like so giddy here, I can barely talk. Um, very, very iconic set. A lot of TTMers try to get this Super Bowl um, set signed through um, Pro Set from back in the day. Um, immediately, I'm thinking, I'm seeing Hall of Fame inscriptions. I'm seeing a donation. Um, I'm shaking and stumbling like an idiot. Um, I've never seen this particular card. This is super freaking cool. And that might be why I've never seen this card. Um, these cards get shipped directly to these Hall of Famers um, for them to give out to people and to sign and so on and so forth. So typically you won't see these um, on eBay and all that unless he gave it out to someone himself and they're selling it. Um, <laughs> this is so freaking cool, dude. Um, oh, okay, let me catch my bearings here. Um, and there's a note here. What's going on? <laughs> what is this? Um, okay, dear Unruh, thanks for your service. Your friend, Johnny Robinson, let me know when you receive the package. Um, I wonder if there's an email or phone number somewhere I'm missing. Um, holy smokes, if not, I can just send a thank you card. Oh. I like keep telling myself here to calm down. I'm like all over the place. These, oh my gosh, are just absolutely freaking beautiful. Holy smokes. Here's that card that I sent that was kind of water damaged that has the bow in it. Oh man, 1970. And there it is. There's his, his rookie card. Every single item is Hall of Fame inscribed. Sent two extra cards just for the kindness of his heart. Sent back my $120. Oh, I forgot about this one. Oh, my gosh. Holy smokes. Oh, I don't remember seeing that huge crease there um, before, but oh, well. These, oh man, this is a freaking home run, man. Out of the freaking park. What a return. Never in a million years would I have thought it would have turned out this amazing. Um, holy smokes. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Robinson. Um, this is definitely going <laughs> to, this is one of my favorite um, player error returns. How awesome is this? Um, let me get off the camera. I'm just babbling like an idiot right now. Um, Till next time, adios, be safe, bye-bye, toodles. Thanks for the support, y'all. This one was an awesome return.